for this video, let's create this really cool film look inside of DaVinci Resolve. So let's just immediately jump in. I have a collection of shots here from my trip to DC, and we're just gonna come in and create a really cool filmic look to give this more of a retro feel. And we're gonna do this completely from scratch. So the first thing I'm gonna do is come in and we're gonna add a color space transform. Shot this in S log three. So there we go. We've converted our footage to Rec 709. Now we can start creating our look. So I'm just gonna quickly copy and paste this transform to all of the clips. That way they're all converted to Rec 709. We wanna pick a pretty balanced image to start creating our film look. So I'm gonna start with this shot right here of the Capitol. We'll add a new node. We'll open up effects and we're just gonna type in film. Let's apply this film look creator and just see what we can come up with. You can come in here and choose default 35 mil look, a 65 mil look, a cinematic look, a bleach bypass, nostalgic, or you can do default no effects and add all of your own, clean slate, or completely custom. I actually kind of like this nostalgic preset, so let's start there and see what we can come up with. We can do color blend, we can do the effects blend. Let's go in here to the different looks. Kind of like that one. We're coming to our color settings. A little bit more contrast down on the highlights a little. Don't want to fade too much. I like our white balance a smidge warm. We can correct a little of that green tint. Just playing with these settings to see what it looks like. Let's come down. We definitely want some halation. Let's add a little bit of bloom. Let's do some 35 mil grain, but we don't want a ton. We'll adjust that film gate a little. That's a really cool aspect ratio. Okay, I think that's looking pretty cool so far. Let's come back down to our colors. Just adjust that a smidge more, a little bit more warmth. Let's add back in a little saturation. So that's looking pretty cool. Let's apply this to all of our clips and then go through individually and see what effect it had and if it works for all of our clips. So we're just gonna select copy, select all and paste. Now let's just go through, let's just see what it looks like so far. Honestly, that is a pretty cool look throughout. There's a few of these, like this one that's a little bit overexposed. So we could just come in and give that one some adjustment. Now let's play that through. Maybe bring it down just a little bit more. And this is pre a pretty strong look that I created. You could do this in a really subtle way if you wanted to, but I really wanted to have some heavy halation, some heavy blooming of the highlights just to give it that really retro feel. And I think we achieved that just might make some final adjustments to some of these clips. And here's our final video created to give this a nice film look. Washington, D.C., a place where the American spirit is a tangible feeling. The ambitious businessman meets the museum-loving tourist as public transportation propels each individual to their desired destination. This is the place where the modern meets the historic in a beautiful display of progress and tradition. The architecture, monuments, and museums speak of the sacrifices and soul that made the United States what it is today. 
a place of life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Some might argue that the American dream no longer exists, but we still have the ability to become whatever we set our minds to, and that feels pretty American to me. Here, every breath feels like freedom and is a reminder that this truly is the greatest nation on earth. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. I've never really played around a lot with a film look, so this was one of my first times just kind of diving in, giving it a go, but I love the film look creator inside DaVinci because it gives you all those tools already available. I know there are tons of really cool plugins that you can purchase that give an even better film look, but having this one already inside DaVinci already, you can get a really nice film look without having to buy any plugins or do any extra work. Anyway, I'm just kind of playing around with getting into film looks. Let me know in the comments, what's your favorite film look? What are some of your settings that you love to use? I know you can achieve film looks using LUTs, but I wanted to try it this way using Color Space Transform and creating a look completely, you know, manually using DaVinci settings. But let me know in the comments, what's your favorite film look? Do you like really heavy styles? Do you like light styles? Do you like just adding a little grain, a little halation? Just let me know in the comments below. Hopefully you found some value in this, learned something new about DaVinci, and if you did, check out some of my other DaVinci videos on my channel as part of my DaVinci series.